the black man is never going to get respect from the rest of society until he upholds his woman. That's right. Nobody makes mockery of their woman. That's right. The black woman possesses more testosterone than the white male. That's, that's a fact. But the white man has convinced the black man that strength is not femininity. That's right. The black man is blessed with a powerful, strong woman that the white man can't handle. And so he teaches the black man that his woman, who is a made woman, who is unattractive, undesirable, to the point where he was crawling down into the slave cabins. That's why all of us are here today as hybrids. Come on. He teaches the black man to reject his woman, but he wants that black woman. And he has used all of his technology to give his woman lips behind color and all of those things that he desires in the black, brown, and red woman. And so the black woman has to respect the black man and the black man has to protect and provide because it is the nature of the female to demand good treatment. So she's going to nag, she's going to curse, she's going to go off the deep end because the Honorable Elijah Muhammad said, the woman is not made to undergo financial stress. It's not in her genetic makeup. So she can't be consoler that she needs to be to her man so that when he comes in from fighting this devil all day long she can soothe his mind soothe him physically emotionally mentally and spiritually but she can't do that if her needs are not met